switch. They don't really want to start a ride. They don't really want to start a ride. They don't really want to come and try. Took a trip, now we taking sprints. I wasn't made to jog. I'm on ships, rolling cause a grip. I must major now. Stop, boy. I got. And coming up next, it's a UFC welterweight division matchup. Oh, is it good to see this guy making the walk. I'm just glad I don't have to fend off his chokes tonight. This is a decorated Brazilian jiu-jitsu practitioner. And a lot of guys in the UFC just not used to facing opponents on this level. He's probably thinking right now, how quickly can I get this fight to the ground and utilize my high-level submission skills? Scary, scary BJJ practitioner, finally where he belongs here in the octagon. This guy is an outstanding wrestler, and what he wants to do here is avoid any striking confrontations, close the distance, grab a hold of his opponent, and bring the fight down to the ground where he should have an advantage. All right, so here he is, folks. This fighter has been all the rage of late, but tonight what stands in front of him, a legitimate rivalry fight. He's been talking a lot of smack here during fight week. He does not like his opponent, and the same can be said reciprocally. His opponent doesn't like him either. Tonight, they close the octagon door behind him. This guy is extremely well-rounded. His submissions are world-class. His striking is excellent. And he is extremely unpredictable in what attack he chooses to go with. Welterweight fight. Both fighters are 26, with some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, we send it back inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC Welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a grappler, holding a professional record of five wins, four losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 169 pounds, Mr. Untouchable. And now to his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, 
holding the professional record of six wins, one loss. He stands 63 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Kenosha, Wisconsin, Big Danny. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. Mario Yamasaki, third man in the octagon for this one. You ready? Let's go, come on! strike here to end the fight early in the first. Yeah, Joe, that was the perfect shot right there. We didn't even get a feeling out process here tonight, and we say it all the time. Sometimes when you catch a guy cold before he's had a chance to get going in the fight, it can have a bigger effect. It certainly had a huge impact here tonight as he gets the win by first round KO. And here we see it again. Crank right on the jaw. Well, what a moment for this fighter here tonight. A massive knockout on the sport's biggest stage. Seminal moment for that fighter tonight. And we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop in this contest at 18 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Big Daddy. All right, so the celebration is on in the corner, and he has certainly earned it after coming through and coming up large in this rivalry fight here tonight. He wanted this one in the worst way, and man, did he seize the spotlight here in this one.